Hey everybody, Justin from FrugalSnobs.com. Brooks sent me say hello. Hello. But everybody, another quick drink review. Folks have been really digging our reviews. So wherever you enjoy content from the Frugal Snobs, particularly video content, whether it be YouTube or elsewhere, make sure you hit that subscribe button. It helps us out. Also make sure that you like, share, comment, post. We do our part, please do your part. If you like what you see in here, please make sure that you check out the Frugal Snobs podcast. Everything you need to know is at frugalsnobs.com. If you'd like to support us, you can support us by going to support.frugalsnobs.com and supporting us for as little as 99 cents per month. Now, let's go ahead and get into this review, folks. This review is for the Carib Premium Caribbean Style Lager, according to Christina, from Florida Beer Company. Uh, I enjoyed this particular brew, folks, out of a flying dog chalice, like the Cross promote. Uh, this brew has a nice light yellow, light amber color. Uh, nice head on this, by the way, on the pour. But what's interesting about it is the scent. So, Christina, this is out of a can. So you smelled the can, yes. and you smelled hints of pineapple. Yeah. And you smell it now, hints of pineapple. By the way, folks, Christina's holding the can as we record this review. Yeah. So I gave this a smell in the glass after the pour, and Christina, you did as well. And I. I, I think I detected hints of a V8. I agree. So a tomato soup smell almost. Um, don't let that fool you folks. I actually really enjoyed this brew. It carries a 5% ABV. Very drinkable and crisp. I would enjoy very cold. Um, I enjoyed this with some lime tortilla chips, actually. Uh, I would enjoy, again, with either lime chips or something salty, maybe honey roasted peanuts. Pretzels. Yes, something that carries some kind of flavor or texture change for the palate. Really good. I would definitely enjoy... Probably as either, you know, again, pub grub based or standalone. But be careful, folks. When you get up to a beer or some other brew that you like, whether it's a, a beer or specifically or a stout or something like that, especially when it carries a particular ABV or percentage of by volume, just be careful, right? We, we want everybody to enjoy responsibly. So I enjoyed this brew, folks. Beer Advocate gives this brew a 2.82. I have to disagree. I'd probably give this a four-star snob rating. It's pretty good. So, as always, please enjoy responsibly. Be well. Never pay retail. Take care of yourself and each other.